Charlie, after he told me his story, I said, so what do you think about America? He said, best place in the world, right? Best place in the world. We need, we really need to understand that with all our faults and everything that went on today in the last three or four weeks, we're still the best country in the world. And um, thank you for uh, reminding us of that. Our next uh, artist is Matt Ernsberger. I was sitting in church about 15 years ago and I forget, we were, for some reason we were doing some kind of concert and I'd never met the guy before and he comes up and he does the greatest Tom Jones imitation ever. <laughs> my, my, my Delilah, I'll never forget it. I, was, and I went, whoo! So I asked him to come and play for us tonight. Matt, you're on. Hello, Music Village. The people not involved in Music Village. My name is Matt. I uh, I am uh, kind of a local musician. Played a lot of. I wouldn't really call myself a musician because I've never actually. I play drums and I've sung at the same time. I've never actually played guitar and sung at the same time. But I've written all these songs. Yeah, right. Here he is. Right? Here he is. Uh, uh, so I am. Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing what happens this evening. It's all a process. I didn't even tune. So, Jake, just to uh, ignore it. Um, I. Uh, so my story, I guess, is going to be something along the lines of. Uh, not quite like the last story. I, I grew up in uh, suburban America. <laughs> Did not cross any rivers for freedom, which is fantastic, awesome, fabulous, and amazing. Um, I uh, I grew up uh, in, in a church. Uh, Mark says that I should mention the church, but I'm uh, I'm afraid I do not want to cross any you know boundaries. So I'm just going to say a church. Uh, I was Calvary Baptist. So I don't know. So, <laughs> so I, uh, <laughs> um, I, uh, my story is I've I've always done music. I've always done some form of uh, I don't know the theater or, or whatever it is, and uh, it started in the church. I was born on a Tuesday uh, in church on that Sunday, and uh, uh, there were all kinds of cantatas. Anybody know what a cantata is? It's good, because I don't want to explain it. And uh, so, I, I, you know, I was like five years old, I was in cantatas, and I kind of just caught the bug. I was like, music, you know, like singing, the theater, the, the drama of it. And uh, I, I, was, I started doing theater stuff, started doing all kinds of, uh, well, she knows, she was there. Yeah, Jesus Christ Superstar did that, uh, did a lot of stuff in high school. My phone is vibrating. Why is my phone vibrating? That's my wife. Hold on. Uh, no, I, I would answer it, but I'm on stage, so it's kind of an issue. Um, so, too many witnesses. So, I, uh, I just always done music. Um, I'm still currently, I'm like currently in a band called Memphis Underground, which is a lot of fun. I'm singing that band. Do not sing and play at the same time. Which you'll see why, and uh, so it's a uh, it's it's I don't know it's just I don't really have a whole lot of story to share other than music has always been a part of my life. The music village is going to build uh, on that kind of idea where when you're plugged in and you start to feel what music does and what music uh, uh, how that I've, I've made so many friends like Di Rocker and, and, and Jake. And, Mark's not a musician, he, he already uh, said he wasn't, but uh, obviously music has made an impact in his life because he just told the story of a, my, 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 do I love my <laughs> So it, it is an interesting and kind of fascinating uh, <clears throat> aspect of the human life, how music affects us. It's Somebody once mentioned that it's, 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 it is the, it's like a vocalizing of emotions, right? It is, you know, sometimes we can't express what we feel, except that we express it um, with music. 
And uh, so along those kind of thoughts and lines, I was going to say that uh, I'm not much of a storyteller. I've always been more of an actor. I mean, utilizing other people's lines, other people's words. Uh, I wrote a lot of songs many years ago, uh, 20 some years ago, and uh, I haven't really written anything lately or played anything lately. Uh, but uh, I've never played and sung at the same time. So when Mark asked me to do this, I was like, what? I could, I could play drums and sing, but there's, you know, there's, so this is going to be an, an, an interesting journey for, for all of us. So we'll, uh, we'll, this is a song I wrote about 20 years ago, touching on the whole drama thing, the, the whole idea of just emotion kind of out there. This song is about uh, uh, me looking in a mirror. This is when I was 20 years 17, 18, 20 years old, just looking in the mirror and going, you know, this person is not who I think I am. I, I want to be better. I want to be the things I think. And it, it, when I look back at this poem, I thought, you know, things haven't really changed. You know, we all kind of look in the mirror and go, really? Is that who I am? Is that what I look like? Is that who I feel? You know, I, sometimes I, I still ask those questions. Reflections of you 
Oh, no. 